they saying, Lady LeBron. She a beast, just check out how she performs. <laughs> Are you ready to start on our downsides in the worst? Man, we doing it tonight. It's six o'clock. Tonight is the night tonight. We don't wait till everybody in bed. We know we got last year. Tonight is the night, baby. You trying to watch this shit here? Look, it ain't gonna take long for you. You said fifteen minutes of that. I took your bed down. I folded the clothes. Look, the couch ain't been like that in a long time. Get me off live. I don't want nobody looking at me right now. You're not on live. <laughs> okay. I wanted to make sure I wasn't on live. But I promise I'm going to help you. But this is so good. Like, they ain't had power on in months. And it's finally back. Honey. This is the last one. You it's get, on. what time is it? 627. So you be ready by 730? Sure. Give you one hour from right now to start, okay? You gonna fix us a salad? No. Ain't you hungry? No, I ate some of my sandwich. Uh, you, what my other two is? You only had one. We had one and one. Uh, what about the other? The other? That's mine. Yeah, not your fault. <laughs> <laughs> that shit do. All right, I'll be back in one hour. Okay. Okay? All right. Can you get out so we can get fed without anatomy talk? We talk about the heart and the brain. You want me to get out too, Jeremiah? Tell her the truth, bro. She ain't got to say no. No comment. Yeah, yeah, that's the smartest shit you ever did in your life. <laughs> so, you, you guys. <laughs> Our room is chaotic. Because we are trying to figure out what we're keeping and what we're not keeping. So. I ain't got a lot of shit anyway. You trying to say I got a lot of shit? Shit, look at the closet. That's your shit. You just need some help. You don't want to help me? I'm going to help you. All right, let's do this. Let's go. What? Where are your outfits? Why are you in here watching me? You totally picking what you want. You go first. <laughs> let, 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 let's let the people see. You pick 10 outfits. I am. This is okay. One. I want this shirt. Uh, this is RV living 2020. I want this shirt. 2021 going into the 22-2. A lot of the stuff I haven't even worn yet. I really like this. This is one of my favorites. Okay. You can keep that. They I just... have to keep my lady bling. Okay. I have three. To keep they make three guys. No, this is a shirt. No, this three. <laughs> I really, I, see, I ain't having no hard time because I really don't want a lot of this shit. I want these shorts. Bo. Them so <laughs> shorts. That's not an outfit. <laughs> What do we have over this side? I don't want this a lot. Why this I gotta side? keep this jacket. Why this Five, and seven. I wear this shirt a lot though, don't I? Keep it, baby. That's you. Okay, I'm gonna keep this shirt too. And Depends. that's all I want. That's all you want? Yeah. Well, get your bags then. Let's put this this bag this shit. Okay. Okay. All you, right, you see, turn. she about to cry. I'm not. She's about to fucking cry. Look I'm at okay her. I'm okay with what I have. Now the rest of this stuff can go in the bag. Okay. Your turn. <laughs> your shit ain't in here. Where you hide your shit at? <laughs> your shit somewhere else. I, I got enough shit. What about, so, you getting rid of your wedding dress, your own city? The wedding dress? Yeah. What can I do with it? You think somebody you think somebody about it? I don't know. No. You right, I ain't holding none of your shit in here. I'm gonna get a bag and go ahead and start putting this stuff in. I don't believe you though. I am. I got one thing, I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep this. Okay. Cause I think I want this thing like three times. 
Okay. No, I'm gonna give it away. You gonna give it away? Yeah. Your clothes missing. Something ain't right. Where your shit at? Look, I got you hiding shit. You see me look, only thing I'm taking is what we got in the luggage and them free little pants on it. So it's really just me got to let all my shit go. Wow. You got shit somewhere hiding. Not here. I, we ain't taking the wood up. But you got your shit put up. Right. I told my brother in, in two years, if I don't ask for this shit, when we get a house, I'm going to tell you to send it to me. Send it to the So well, you actually got somebody holding your clothes. Yeah. Why not? Well, you got a point, honey. Ain't no you problem. was going to make me throw this shit on the street. Uh-huh. I have nice attire. Okay, honey. That's fine. But I'm, I'm going to get this away. I'm not going to leave. It's fine, honey. You can keep that. I'm not going to keep that. You can do what you want to do. It's cool. No, it's okay. I just throw my stuff away. I'm giving my stuff away. What? You sure you want to do this? Do what? Throw all your goddamn clothes away. I'm not throwing them away. I'm giving them to Sabrina. Let her go through them. Whatever she don't want, she can go and get to the wheel. Um, Somebody get to look through them. So really just get this shit away. Just put this in. Just let it go. We have to just let it go. Well, she has begun, you guys. It has begun. Start over. You said you like this dress. I do. You need to keep that one. Oh, you can't. Okay. I'm not keeping Okay. This right here is old as dirt, too. Not really. I think we should, like, keep, put all of the clothes we really, really, really want in a pile. And then go through, like, a sudden death moment. A sudden death? Yeah. What do you mean? Like, take everything that we really, really want and put it in a pile. And you sit in front of your pile. I sit in front of my pile. And we really go ahead and make the final decisions on yay or nay. These have, I have seen these since we've been married. I've never seen you wear them. Because they feel like special occasions and shit. Like, you making me give up, like, you, so she just, it's not an everyday or every month outfit. You know what I'm saying? This for like. So this is a key. Yeah. Probably is a keeper. Like, if we ever want to step out of something or we got to go somewhere, and that, I don't have to buy none. Those are good pants. Them motherfuckers cost 100 bucks. All right, I'm going to buy past your stuff. No, get rid of that. What? This? Yeah. You get rid of yours. This could be for anything. Really? Yeah. That's what you just said. Oh, I hate to let this go. Keep it. it. That motherfucker weigh a half, a, a half, not even a whole pound. That is not going to hurt 5,000 pounds. Well, oops, I'm sorry, 700. I'm doing shoes. You're doing shoes? You're keeping those? Let me see if this one. Uh, uh. This is my pile I have to go through so far. But you put them, give me them clothes over there. All this stuff, I'm finna. Why do you keep, will you just go? Dang, she been in my face ever since I started. I really ain't trying to keep too many long sleeves because I really think we're going to be in a lot of warm places. So I'm real big on keeping a lot of the summer stuff. And my face is getting back fat again. It's very round. So like I said, once they start seeing us clear a lot of stuff out, I think it's going to become more of a reality check to all of us. How you feeling over there? Scared. Scared of what? Man, you might get, it's a big decision, boo. 
Is it starting to hit you a little bit more now that we actually packing up all this stuff and getting rid of all this stuff? Yeah. Like, what are you afraid of? Are you afraid of failure? No. I'm just saying, you know, I have packed up and just left this motherfucker before, though. But I always come back. But it's different with a wife. You want to do it. Like, when I would do it, I ain't had no kids. So it's really different. Good. Just up and go and call a motherfucker. Hey, man, I'm on my way. You for real? Yeah, for real, I'm coming. And just go. But with me being with you and kids being with you, it's different. Mm-hmm. All right, now it's time to face these fucking shoes. So how many pairs of shoes are we keeping? <laughs> are we gonna be able to put this shit on that damn thing? What you mean? I, I mean, we said we keeping four pairs of shoes, right? Yeah. The rest of the shoes, I'm saying we can put them in their tote to for sale, but we can't do them with their tote itself. I don't know. <sighs> okay, what about these? Sale. Yeah, we got two on sale. These. Sale. Somebody will buy them. I want this boot so fucking bad, but I can't. I can't find it. Maybe it'll come up in the middle of the, of the breakdown. No, it's not. It's haven't been missing that long, has it? Yeah. You ain't seen that. Y'all ass constant stretching out like we ain't got shit to do. That's not helping. Oh, you suck. What about your your smooth daddies? These nice. I don't think you should let these go. I like these. you to keep these because they brighten up my day okay i like the, what side of those i think that was hurting my toes a little bit 11 okay keep them what about the rough buddy the, i the, cannot let those go what you about know the that i need those <laughs> the motherfuckers are kicking your ass and get stuck <laughs> Relax all time. I am relaxed. Okay, I'm coming on right now because I am frustrated. I'm very frustrated because right now I have a pile of clothes that I feel like is a must keep. And I still have clothes that I'm washing. And my pile is still too fucking big. My husband is giving all of his clothes, well, half of his clothes, his good clothes, to the boys. But the girls can't fit my clothes. So, I really have to just pick what I absolutely want. And I really want all of it. This is my pal. And I really want all of it. I need this stuff. She fucked up, y'all. I need this stuff. She is fucked up. I'm getting one all my shit and she trying to keep out of them club. Don't they look like more than 10 outfits? They look like 30. So, 
we have started the downsizing process. Um, you know, I was getting on the kids, you know, saying we were doing things as a family. Okay, right now we are downsizing. Letting a lot of these clothes go. We are all doing it as a family. I need pain. Call up. This is the, don't say pay just off. Give it to me. I want them. Uh -uh. You want Give what? To oh, downsize, but I am the only person that's really having a problem with the downsizing. Um, um, <clears throat> you know, I was laughing about how my husband was going to have a hard time letting the TV go. Um, you know, I was really getting getting on to the children about letting things go and whatever you don't have, I just buy it again. But now it's my turn, and my room is just chaotic. It's extremely chaotic. This is currently my room. I have pulled everything out of my closet. <sighs> I'm going through my hairs. I have a purse over there. Like this is my bag for me to put my stuff in. And it's just, it's so much that I want to keep. It's so much like, it's so much stuff. I just don't even know where to start. I'm getting to be very frustrated, but I have to gain control of the situation. Okay, I really hate recording on this side because the footage isn't as clear as it is on the other camera, but I'm, I'm not that skilled yet with recording um, different angles yet, but um, my hardest thing is the shorts because I really plan on being in a lot of warm areas. I don't plan on going to a lot of cold places. So I'm really big on keeping my shorts. And like these shorts I've never worn before. And they're so cute. And I just don't wanna let them go. So right now I have to be realistic and ask myself, you know, what are my must keeps and everything else I have to let go? Like I literally already have a full bag outside of my door of stuff that I'm giving away. Um. So let's let's get let's get to it, okay? Okay, so this is my bag. I am going to have to put the stuff that I just. I'm gonna have to be a big girl and let go in this bag. And I'm gonna create my pile of what I must keep. So, like I said, these I have to keep. These are kind of big, so I think I'm gonna let those go. These are the, oh, I was gonna lie. I was gonna say these are the only a pair of white shorts that I own, but it's actually two pair. But these are more of the, you know, sophisticated white short, and these are more of the thotty white short because they're shorter with the little rip. Like, I love shorts. I'm going to keep both of these. Okay, that puts me at three. Okay. These. This puts me at four. These. Puts me at five. See, that's what I'm saying. Like, I'm not progressing at all. These right here are kind of like my cleanup shorts because they're black and they're faded, but they're still good just for doing stuff. My tights. I need my tights. Like all of my little tights. Who doesn't need their tights? Like I haven't even worn these tights here before yet. 
Look at them. They kind of have like a metallic. Like these tights are a must keep. Right? These tights I probably don't have to keep. Okay, this jacket, I really want this sweatshirt. This is my ugly money sweatshirt. There you go. This is my sweater, like my um, pullover dresses. I really want these. I have like three of these. I have a gray, a black, and a white. This is a dress. It's a dress. It's like a hoodie dress. Let me think on that. This shirt. I probably can let this shirt go. Because I don't really wear it. That was easy. That was easy. Now, this is a skirt that I plan on wearing at the beach because look at it. It's like high on one side and low on the other side. And I pull it up to where it shows a lot of my thigh. Like, I got to keep that. I got to keep it. It's important. Like, that's what I envision happening in my mind. My workout outfit. Like, I plan on walking on some of the trails like getting back in shape so that's why i'm saying i really need my tights and my little workout clothes that i have i need this stuff now this is a classic this says lady bling on the back i got this spray painted in atlanta like This I, I, I gotta think on that. Um, what is this t shirt? This is just a plain black tee, which can go with anything. Like, I need that because I have all these shorts and no tops, right? <sighs> okay, I'm gonna get ready and just like I pretty much got my pal right here. These, these shorts and tights i'm pretty much gonna get ready and stop and everything else i'm gonna let go okay i'm gonna let go so this is a scarf i'm gonna keep the scarf i'm keeping all of my undies and bras of course get that over there um i have a lot of towels because like i said i just been washing everything in the house it's just some extra crap. I've been eating and stuff, but yeah, keeping all of our undies. A lot of this stuff is like my husband's stuff that he said he still wants. And then I have a lot of slot of time merchandise because you know I, I sell my slot of time shirts. So I I actually found a lot of merch after taking everything out of my closet, and so I can just give those away. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to just give all of these to my clients as a farewell gift. So I just came up with that since we've been on here. I think that'll be super dope. Or I can give them out as I travel. I don't know, but they're just good to hang out. This shirt, I had a hard time letting go because it goes good on the beach as well. I've worn this shirt a couple of times. It gives me like... Spice Girl vibes. It you know has like that little long shoulder and the crotch the crotch crop top. I love shirts like that. That I can't let that go. I can't let this go. And this is one of my favorite tops too. It's a see through and it got the Spice Girl flare arm. You know the bell bottom arm too. I need this. 
and my pile is not getting no smaller. This is what I'm saying. I'm just vlogging for shit. I'm basically vlogging for shit because I want all this shit. Let me get this jacket. Look at this jacket. Like, how can I let this jacket go? Look at it. Like, who throws a jacket like this? Who gives a jacket like this away? No one. No one does. I'm keeping my jacket. I like this jacket. And I love this jacket. I actually got this jacket from a boutique. It has a lot of little metal spikes on the front of it. Like, you know, I can't let that go. I'm, I'm going to... I thought I was going to be able to get on here and be able to like pick what I want, pick what I don't want, but I'm not going to be able to do it. I think I'm just going to have to really invest in some vacuum bags and just like really make kids clothes a part of my children's Christmas list because now I feel bad because I, I, they did like let go of a lot of stuff, which it was a lot of stuff that they weren't wearing. Like I wear my stuff. Like my little savage, this is another dress. Who can get with that savage dress? I'm not gonna do it. And y'all won't even believe, like I damn near even cleared. This is the bed sheet that I'm putting on my queen size bed in the camper. So that's why that's up here. But y'all won't believe, like I've damn near cleared the bed because these are more scarves and bras almost everything that was on here was my shit and i haven't even went through my shoes and my purses yet okay so basically this is my shoe box that I am keeping, but we originally agreed to keep four pairs of shoes a piece, and I have way more than four. Um, like my Indian sandal, I've I've only worn these once, once. Um, my little rainbow shoe, like I have a lot of different. Well, these are kind of dirty. They're dirty, but I can clean them. I just like them because I have a lot of little accessories and earrings that I bought to go with these. And I just want to let them go. This boot, actually, I can't even find the other boot. But I love this pair so much. I'm just hoping that it'll come up in the middle of us moving. And I don't want to let it go when it comes up. So this is probably still going to go. But this is like a peak toe thigh boot. Like... No. And like my husband's talking about my Spice Girl shoe, but this is a classic. Okay? These go with anything. This is a neutral color. I'm not getting anywhere. I'm not getting anywhere. Um. I have so many pairs of shoes. I have so many clothes. I have so many wigs. I want all of it. I want it all. And I can't keep it all. And I have I've gone too far now to turn away. So basically, this is something that I'm having an issue with. I truly do not know where to start. 
it's so chaotic. I don't even know how to vlog it because even the things I've said I'm letting go, I'm not sure if I'm letting it go. Like, I want all of my shorts. I want all of my tights. I want all of my wigs. I want all of my purses. I collect jewelry boxes. Like, I have been collecting jewelry boxes ever since my mom gave me hers when I was a little girl. And, um, you know, I've just been infatuated with jewelry boxes and I've collected them. And now I, I've consumed so many over the years. I know I can't take them all. And then I keep telling myself, you know, just put some of the stuff in the storage for when you come back. But the key is to get rid of the bills. Like, I don't want the storage bill. So, I'm going to have to redo this vlog over. I'm going to have to probably maybe watch some other YouTube videos on how to downsize. Figure out a way to be a little bit more organized with my downsizing. And just probably come back on here when I have the ultimate last items as far as what I'm going to keep. I'm really thinking about going to my camper and maybe looking around to see, you know, exactly how much storage do I have. But I'm really thinking about, you know, the vacuum bags. Because I don't want to let nothing go like this. I have a whole week right here that I still haven't played with. She's really looking happy. But... Once I roll her and move her and snap her back, like she hasn't even had her turn. And I have like five or six weeks like this. Like, y'all stay tuned. But they saying Lady LeBron She a beast, just check out how she performs